everyone and welcome to a new video. This time we are doing a shell challenge and I'm super excited about this because I love to do shell challenges and I'm super excited to host my first one now. <laughs> I don't know, in the past months I've just... It was so much fun for me to participate in so many shell challenges and I don't know. I think it's just amazing what you can do with just one shell. <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah, but I'm just quickly going to show you the shell. So um, I think it's okay. It's not too difficult. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not that big. And also, yeah, I don't know. It has two stories and also not weird things outside of the shell. <laughs> which I personally um, find pretty difficult to incorporate with the build. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think it's okay like that. Um, yeah, so I'm just quickly going to explain to you what the shell challenge, what shell challenge means. <laughs> um, at least uh, my personal rules I set up for this challenge. I know that everyone does it a little bit different, but for me, this is how it goes so <laughs> um, you are not allowed to touch these walls which means you cannot like delete things like this or not like this that's not okay that's not allowed and also you cannot like do this or this or this and this <laughs> um, yeah you cannot place walls outside of the wall uh, of the shell like directly connected to the shell. Um, so you have to keep these walls how they are. <laughs> um, you can, however, place like some house here if you want to or here. That's totally okay too. So it's just important that the walls don't touch these walls. Like this wouldn't be okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's the main thing which you have to keep in mind. Um, also, this is a tiny shell for me, so um, you have to make it less than 100 tiles. So it's, I think it's called, how is it called? <gasps> Tier 3, the small home. It has to, yeah, it has to have less than 100 tiles. Um, now it has 61 tiles, um, but you can make it a little bigger if you want to, which is possible with foundations because you can use foundations wherever you want to. You can use them here or you can make them like uh, here. That's totally okay, as long as you don't change these walls. <laughs> um, yeah, so if you don't have tiny living, that's totally okay too. Um, you maybe just have to count the tiles, I don't know, and make sure that it's not bigger than 100 tiles. <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah, that's also okay like that. Um, and also you can change the wall height if you want to, like this or like this, however you want to. Um, and you can also rotate the whole lot like this and you can just make maybe this the entrance or this or I don't know, whatever you want to. And um, yeah. Also, you can place it on any lot you want. It doesn't have to be this one and it also doesn't have to be a 20 by 15. It can be a big lot, a small lot, whatever you want. And it also doesn't have to be a residential lot. It can also be a community lot, like a, a restaurant or a swimming pool. I don't know, <laughs> whatever you want. Um, it's totally up to you, as long as it's functional, <laughs> um, because um, yeah, I think that it has to be functional because I enjoy it more with functional builds and I try to make all my builds functional and I don't know, I think it's more difficult to make the houses functional. So another challenge more <laughs> for you. <laughs> um, yeah, and also you cannot use any custom content um, because I don't have any furniture from custom content in the build and buy. <laughs> um, so if I would download your shell or your build, then it would there would be many items missing probably. So you cannot use CC, but you can use the red shelf and you can also use the tool mod because 
it doesn't make the build marked as CC, so that's okay. <laughs> um, yeah, and also you can add fences if you want to, of course. You can add them like here or like here or also like this. That's okay. The fences can touch the walls. <laughs> um, and also like up here. That's also okay. Um, you can also use half walls up here like this or like this and also like this or like this. I don't know. You can also use the halfways here. Um, yeah, that's totally fine as long as you don't use these walls here. Oh no, not like that. What happened there? Like this. So <laughs> that's not okay. Just touch. Don't touch the walls. Yeah. And also you can of course add walls to the interior however you want to. Like this or this. I don't know how you want to but um, yeah. You can add walls to the interior. <laughs> um, yeah, And also of course for the roofing you can just do it as usual because you won't need any walls here I think <laughs> for the roofing. Um, yeah so um, I think that's about it. Oh and also one thing uh, you can use any packs you want to so it's not pack restricted. Um, yeah so that's yeah <laughs> it also doesn't matter if you only have base game because I think your build will be beautiful anyway. <laughs> so um, that's okay too. Yeah, so I'm really looking forward to all of your entries and I can't wait to see them. Um, I'm actually going to do a YouTube video about them and I'm going to tour some of them. Like, I think like the favorite ones I'm going to tour. Like, um, I will go through each one of them and the ones, I don't know, like the five top maybe or I don't know, <laughs> depending on how many entries I get. <laughs> um, I will um, tour them on YouTube and also post them on Instagram. And yeah, also I forgot to mention that. <laughs> um, actually, the why I do this challenge is to celebrate my 1000 followers on Instagram. And I think this is just amazing that I've reached such an amount of followers and I don't know, I just couldn't never ever, I never imagined that. <laughs> so I think it's amazing. And I think that a shell challenge will be quite nice to celebrate that. I don't know, but I'm super excited to see what you're all going to do with it. And I think I'm going to build my own house out of it now. <laughs> um, because as I said, I love ch challenges and of course I have to participate in my own challenge too. <laughs> um, yes, so I hope you're all having a lot of fun with this challenge and I hope I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!